Is your um I was on, at the hospital with my husband. Okay. For two nights because he was surgered. I I think you're too tired. Yes, I am. <laughs> and the air conditioner was bad for my throat, you know. Yeah. I know what it's it. Yeah. Ah, no, it's yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Where are they going? Oh, wow. Air conditioner was bad for my throat. At the hospital, yeah, I was listening. How's your husband doing? Oh, well, right now at home. He's at home already? Yes. Hmm. Yes. Okay. Oops. I know electricity is failing and a huge storm is coming. A huge storm is coming. Yes, of course. And no, all right, right now it's raining here. Oh, really? Yes. Raining too. Mm. Yeah, lights are blinking. Oh, let's see what happens. Um, let me just send a message to your chat. So where were we yesterday, Janice, Jancy, and Jenny? Jenny is coming. <laughs> Jancy is just joining too. What do you remember about yesterday's class? Uh, we was uh, talking about the difference uh, uh, between the past continuous and simple past. We were, yeah, we, we were. were yeah. We were talking about the difference between past continuous and simple past, how the simple past actions can stop uh, an action in in the progressive tense, let's say. That's right. What else? What else? We did a lot of examples, right? Okay. And I told you to practice, go ahead and do your own exercises. And so now, Let's play something, shall we? And just to practice what we learned, I want you to stop my action, okay? Okay? So stop my action. I was teaching when? When the rain began. When the rain began, very good. Okay, so I stopped teaching. Continue, Sandra. Okay, uh, I was uh, taking care of my husband at the hospital when somebody to Janet. Okay, Janet. <laughs> when uh, I called you. Oh, good. When I called you, yeah, I stopped taking care of my husband because you. I called you. Okay, continue, Janet. Um, I was, uh, I was, uh, working at the office when, um, daily. When my, what do you say, jefe? Boss. My boss, uh, called me. Perfect. Continue. And I was no. See no. See, I was eight, eating dinner when I was eating dinner. I uh, was eating dinner. Uh huh. Roberto, Daniela, Jenny, Jacqueline, Oscar. Daniela. Okay. 
Then they're like, so I was eating dinner. Time I, I was talking with my dog. Oh, so you continue the action. Okay, I was eating dinner and I was talking to my dog. No, I was talking with my dad. Oh, and I was talking with my dad. Who wants, who can cut the actions? Um, Jenny? Okay, Jenny, cut the action. So I was eating dinner and I was talking to my dad when Jenny? I was speaking with my mother when the class began. Okay, I think we, we, we lost the, the idea. Let's go back. So, uh, who was it? Ailey said, A yeah, Ailey said, I was eating dinner. Daniela said, and I was talking to my dad. So, what interrupted the actions? When my grandmother came to my house. When when grandma came home. Okay. When grandma came home. When grandma came home. When grandma came home. Okay. So grandma came home and we stopped eating and we stopped talking. Okay. Okay. You got it. Just one last example, Roberto or Jenny, if you want, you can continue with a uh, an action in, in, in progress in the past. Uh, I was playing soccer when... Karen. <laughs> oh, Karen Rodriguez, okay. I was playing soccer when... I'm here, I'm back. Okay, I was playing soccer. Please interrupt the action, Karen. Ah, okay. Uh, when uh, I fell out. When I fell out. Okay, simple. You see, let's continue practice in this way. Try to use yesterday's example, and I challenged you. I challenged you again. Go back to your WhatsApp. Look at the list of verbs and try to apply verbs that you never use. Does that sound like a plan? Teacher, may I, may I say another one? Please. Okay. I was receiving the class when I remembered that the cat sand was in the yard and right now it's raining. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh my God. Hurry up, <laughs> run, run. Well, no, no, okay. why? I mean, huh? yeah, the cat is going to be like, oh, man, really? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay. Cats cats are very picky, right? Cats are very picky. Very picky, yeah. With, with smells. Uh -huh. That's so funny. It doesn't smell nothing at all. I know, I know. That's the point. Yeah, but whenever your cat doesn't find the sand, uh -huh. you're you are going to be in trouble. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, hmm. Forbid. I was forbidding my son to go out. Wow. And then. But he didn't pay attention. He didn't pay attention. Excellent, but he didn't pay attention and he still went out. Okay, it was freezing. It was freezing. What? It was freezing. Freezing, <laughs> ah! Uh huh. In the street. On the street and. Yeah, and I forgot my jacket. And he forgot his jacket. I prohibited him to go out, but he didn't listen. Okay, he didn't pay attention. And it was freezing and he forgot the keys. Oh my, he forgot his jacket. 
So now I'm concerned. <laughs> you see? Let's yeah. make sense, okay? Let's try to make sense. Um, you can challenge a classmate. Go like, for example, Karen, greened. <gasps> greened, G-R-I-N-D. G-R-I-N-D. Uh, no, again, Golf, Romeo, India, November, Delta. Greened. Green. Romeo, Romeo India, India, November. Delta. Delta. Mm -hmm. No, I never heard that. You green. never heard that? Okay. No, don't use Spanish, okay? So green is like when you green corn. For example, when I was a kid, uh, I had to I had to go green corn for the tortillas. You know, my mother, my grandma used to do tortillas. And then after that, I used to deliver the tortillas. Okay. So, green, you green corn, you green coffee. What else? You green beans on the blender, on the blender. Or chata. Oh, you, yep, you greened um, morro seeds. Morro seeds. To make horchata. Delicious. Uh huh. <laughs> Not yet. Cutting, no idea. Okay. Moler. <laughs> Okay, so green, yeah, I did G R I N D. Uh, it's like yeah. this, exactly, no? exactly. To, oh, yeah, I could, yeah, oh, let's no, use our hands. Yeah, I got green. the idea when you, you said beans, when you said corn, I think you say corn, <laughs> coffee, corn, coffee. yeah, um, morro yeah. seeds. I said morro, you don't know what is a morro. <laughs> to make horchata, you say to make horchata, and I get it. <laughs> okay, okay. So go ahead, cut in green. Hmm. green. Make a, make an action in the past continuous. Uh, I was drinking coffee made with. Green beans. With green green beans? Green beans? Green, green beans of coffee. <laughs> oh my god, that's weird. Okay. No, <laughs> no, no, no. No, I yes. was okay. Let's make it a narrative if you want. Let's make more sense okay. to it. As the girl was grinding. Uh-huh. The girl was grinding. Um Hold on, grinding. What? Grinding. The coffee? Grinding frijoles. No, 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 frijoles. Beans. Or grinding frijoles, <laughs> grinding beans. I mean, <laughs> as the girl was grinding beans, grinding the coffee. What happened? Um, a girl was. As the girl was grinding the coffee. When the, the machine. Oh, the machine. Uh huh. The, the, the blender. Was, was in room. Was in. Uh, work wasn't working working wasn't work but that action continued oh uh, yeah and um, what about the blender stopped working okay. stopped when the power working. went out <laughs> okay the power went off correct or went out the blender stopped working okay follow the example one of you uses any verb in that list it's over 150 verbs on that list is for, let me see, nine pages of verbs, what you have on one of the lists. So go ahead, amuse, agree, annoy, hmm. behave, okay. boil. <gasps> Okay, so let's use some vocabulary. So, uh, for example, you can say Janet, boil, Joaquin, care, and so on. And then you give the sentence that will stop the action in the past. Make sense? Yes. Okay, let's do it together. We are just 14. <laughs> We're 14 right now. So let's work together on this in small groups. Okay. Come on, guys, let's go.
तो नहीं तो नहीं ले trying to open the pdf with the the verbs okay in this case if you want you can project or you can um, share your whiteboard or a word document you know so you can create the sentences together Okay. Um, and that's the point. Just say a sentence okay. in present in past continuous and let a classmate stop the action. Okay. Mm -hmm. For example, I was taking a shower, Janet. When I remember it, uh, I was late to go work. When they, my family, Arrive from the trip. Okay. Um, may I? Yes. Okay. What were you doing yesterday morning when I was while I was watching television? Wait, wait. Okay. Okay. What were you doing yesterday morning while I was watching television? Yeah. Nothing to do? <laughs> okay, I will do another one. Wait, yeah. Is that a question? What? Yes, I know, I know that's the question. What? That's the question. It was because it's past continuous. A mm -hmm. question in past continuous. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. But it is too long, right? Too long. Was. Uh huh. Okay. I will do another one, so short, okay. What? No, 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 no. repeat, please. Uh, the long one? Yeah. Yes. Okay. What, Slowly, please. What, what were you doing yesterday morning while oh. I was watching television? Watching what? Television. 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 Yeah. Yesterday I was- um, In the I watching television. Yeah. I was I, I was eating. Uh -huh. oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I was watching television when um, the doctor appeared. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. 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 My example. Um, I was. Driving in the street, uh -huh. when suddenly, when suddenly I receive a um, a call in, by my phone, my wife. Ah, oh, okay. My wife. And, and then, and then I can, I can stop to answer her. You couldn't stop. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Oh, <coughs> yeah. well, there is three. Okay. Three yes, things there. Can I repeat uh, the this? Yes, this please example? repeat. Okay. When my when my yesterday, wife called. When yesterday, my... I was I was uh, driving my in my car in the street when when I suddenly I received. I received a call in the, of my wife oh, and couldn't and couldn't stop in the uh, for um, for answer her okay. for, when my when my my um, wife wife uh huh when man when my wife, uh -huh. called, called me, me. Uh -huh. 
You uh -huh. didn't answer. You uh -huh. didn't answer. And I couldn't answer here, right? Yes. You said no. And I couldn't answer here. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Yesterday, he was driving his car in the street when my wife called me. Yes. Huh? Yes. And I can, I couldn't answer her. Oh, that's, that was very wrong. That's, <laughs> that's wrong. That was wrong. Okay. okay. Uh, Daniel? Uh, like, oh. I was cooking and my mother entered, like, oh, come to the house, came to the house. Mm, I watch TV when the light went out. I was listening music. Listen to music and my sister asked me for help. I was sending the email when the internet went out right now. Um, uh, what did you do when I called you yesterday? Can you repeat? What did you do when I called you yesterday? Uh, in my case, I yesterday. Um, oh, what were you doing when I called you yesterday? I was working with my family and my and we and we are business and you were on business negocio okay business ah uh, business okay <clears throat> you were working in your business uh in your job in a bakery. Ah, really? You, yeah. you work in a bakery? What do you do there? Because I work in a bakery too. <laughs> Every day I eat uh, some bread. <laughs> yeah. Some bread. Get a cup of coffee. <laughs> okay. Where do you work? Yeah. In, in Mexicanos, in the downtown, where do you work? The, the others, where do you work? In Cuscatlán. I live in Candelaria. Candelaria ah, really? Yeah. I think it's right there in the center. And what were you doing when, uh, when started the raining. <laughs> you were reading to start the class. Okay. I had problems with, with connecting to start the class. But now, the
Hello, good evening, everybody. Okay, let's see. Uh, I noticed some areas of improvement. Um, no crean que solo llego y me conecto y no estoy ahí. Eh? No, al contrario, he descubierto a veces funciona eso cuando los alumnos son muy nerviosos y no hablan porque, ay, no es bien el teacher. No, eh, entonces mejor solo escucho y veo áreas de oportunidad y luego las cubrimos. So let's see. Look at your WhatsApp, I mean, your chat here in Zoom. And you will notice that. So to go work, I had to go work. Can somebody help me? How, how is that correct? I went to go work. No, I just... Uh, I'm sorry, I went, I, I went, I went to go work. I'm sorry, what's the right thing to say? How, how, what's the right grammar to use there? What's missing? Maybe you need to say, I, I, go, I go to work. Okay, I go to work. So we're missing the preposition, right? Yeah. Option one, I go to work. Yeah, because you cannot say I go working. I go working and let's clear this out. Have you noticed how some people say, let's go jogging, for example? Okay, let's go hiking. No, what's hiking, right? No. No, let's go shopping. Okay, let's yes. go shopping. So. When you talk about leisure, leisure activities, specifically leisure activities, um, and you know, activities that are just recreational, then you say go, go swimming, go jogging, go biking. Hey, let's go biking on the weekend. Okay, let's go biking on the weekend. Let's go swimming on the weekend. Let's go camping. You got it? But, but in general terms, you cannot have two verbs together under the same grammar, <laughs> under the same grammar. So if you're speaking in past, you cannot um, have two verbs in the past. Does that make sense? You have to separate them. And most likely you will use a preposition to do it. So I go to work. I go to work every morning. Next, four and two, easy. Four and two, very simple. After four, you need somebody? Yes, after. After four, you need what? No? I dare. A noun. And after two, what do you need after two? Uh, a verb. A verb. Just yes. think about it that way, okay? I want you to use this this way. Um, where is the... Oh, there is. Okay, and after two, you need a verb. So, for example... Um, to work, to pray, to sleep. Uh huh. I I like to go uh, for health. Um, I go to the store for milk. Okay. I go to the store direction direction. I go to the store. Now, what's the purpose for milk? Okay. I go to the store to buy milk. Misma gata revolcada, right? I go to the store for milk. I go to the store to buy milk. Two different things, okay? You're saying the same thing, just be careful with four, noun, two, verb. Uh, a good way of practicing this is a question, um, so you can learn more English. <laughs> what does it take for, or what does it take to? Okay. Uh, where is she? Sandra, what does it take to make a thousand dollars? 
in El Salvador a month? Oh, nothing. Doesn't take anything. One hundred dollars. No, a thousand dollars a month. Ah, oh well, one thousand dollars. Yes, of course, something. It, it, it means something. Yeah, but <laughs> what what does it take to make a thousand dollars? Oh wow, well, thirty 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 days a month. No, okay, you're not getting it. Um, let me see, Karen. Karen, what does it take to make a thousand dollars a month? In El Salvador, uh, you have to work in a call center. <laughs> at, le at least, and in a managerial uh, position. Uh, manager position. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. in a managerial position. So, what does it take to be the best manager in a call center? What does it take to be the best manager in a call center? Have a lot of experience. Have a lot of experience. Read a lot of books. People. <laughs> uh -huh. Have a degree. Have a, a university degree. Now, nah, honestly, you just have to meet people, and that's it. Yeah, that's yeah, it. yeah. It's normal. It's normal. Yeah, it's normal. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm just kidding. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So think about these two questions. Okay. What does it take? Hey, what does it take for you to love me? Oh, that's an expression. Then. <laughs> what does it take for you? To love me. What does it take to make you love me? Two different things, okay? And just, uh, you know, unfortunately, I cannot share. I cannot share uh, lyrics, you know, or a song with you. I would like to play with you a dynamic that I typically do with my students. I'll just give you the recommendation. But before we do that, I'm sorry. Well, let me do it really really quick jealous guy <coughs> jealous guy by john lennon and that's that song has only <clears throat> past continuous and simple past okay i was dreaming of the past and my heart was beating fast i began to lose control i didn't mean to hurt you I'm sorry that I made you cry. Mm. I'm just a jealous guy. Oh, it has present simple too. So pay attention to the lyrics and that's and try to to translate with your head without using the the the, the Google Translate tool. Okay, mm. let's look at the lyrics. Look for the lyrics. Okay, let's continue with the uh, feedback really quick on your chat. Listening to music, my sister asked me for help. That's the way some one of you said it. Listening music, what is wrong with that? Listen to music. You listen to music. I was listening to music. Okay. That's the, the whole sentence. I was listening to music. And then? When my sister asked me for help. Perfect. When my sister asked me for help. Hmm. Yeah, ask me for help. She asked me. She asked for help. Okay, my sister asked me for help. You got it. And let's see, what did you do when I called you yesterday? No, what were you doing when I, when I called you yesterday, right? Or can I say, what were you doing? What did you do when I called you yesterday? What did, what did you? I think yes, we can we can say it, but it's a different answer. It's a different <laughs> context. Uh -huh. yeah. What different did you context. do? I get a scare. I like got scared. Not. I couldn't believe it. Let me yeah. give you let me give you a clear example. Um, a month ago, my wife won five thousand dollars from from a Google Sky plan. I think I told you. Well, the thing is that yeah yeah man. And they call her from the radio right away, right? So that's a clear example. Next day, El Turrón from, from EXA called her again. And that's the question he made. Hey, what did you think, right? What was your reaction when I called you? She was like, I couldn't believe it. I mean, it wasn't you. He won $5,000? Yeah, to buy whatever she wanted at Multiplaza. Yeah. <laughs> 
and we end up buying the refrigerator. The you are uh, so happy, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean that was a blessing because that was a blessing because we didn't have sofa. Yeah. There was just one sofa, <laughs> one sofa yeah. in the hammock in the middle of the of the living room. And oh we, my were God. Nice. We, we, we were not we were not planning to buy to buy to buy the, the mm -hmm. yeah the living room you know but things happened now we have a tv a 50 inches tv it's huge i mean we were not expecting that we were not expecting that and that's the last these things happen because of you <laughs> those things never happen in life you know i was like what right yeah but you know what I, I I prayed, I prayed for two weeks and I just, and I just asked God, right? Hey, since I noticed that he gave her, she was like, you know what? I don't want to be rich. I don't want to be rich. Just give me whatever you think All I need. Necessary. Just give me the necessary things. Yeah. Boom. Here you go. You need a new fridge. You need a new, a new kitchen. You need, okay. So I was like, oh my God. Husband. And then I started, <laughs> I need a new husband. Hey, come on, Yancy. Actually, come on. Yeah, actually, I started asking him, you know, hey, uh, help me, help me stop smoking. Help me stop smoking every morning at 4 a.m. Help me stop <sighs> smoking. Okay, <sighs> here's your COVID. <laughs> <laughs> and then <laughs> I haven't, I haven't. Stop smoking. I haven't smoked for three weeks, three weeks without smoking. I feel like, oh my God, I feel weird. I don't know, after, after 26 years, 26 years smoking. And I was like, oh man. Dear me. 26 years, believe it or not. Why is it when the people are smoking, teacher? I don't know, man. I was 14 when I started. But eventually, when you go growing, you yeah. get more responsibilities. I had three, four jobs. So there's a lot of stress. Yeah. And, and in fact, in fact, a doctor told me once, you cannot stop smoking. And I was like, <laughs> why? If, if you, because if you work, if you have four jobs, you have to smoke. Okay. And I was like, you're mm -hmm. a doctor and you're telling me to smoke. And he was like, yeah. Because we have a friend here in this job in English Corporativo, we had a teacher. She's not longer with us, but she um, she suffered some sort of uh, problem, you know, a mental problem due to the stress, of the, <laughs> the, the 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 workload. That's the word. You know what is a workload? Workload. Load. Come on, workload. workload? I heard about burnout. Is, oh is no, burn, burn, burnout. No, no, no. Your workload could be daily. What's your workload like? Mm, okay, when you have a lot of work to do. Yeah. Is, is actually, what's your workload for today? Oh, I don't have too much workload. Mm. Too many responsibilities, a lot of tasks to perform. Yeah, yeah, yeah but her workload was as heavy, was as heavy <laughs> as mine. We had, we worked from Monday to Sunday, you know, in different places but anyways that's that's the way it goes so you have to find a destructor you have to find a destructor that's very important okay um, teacher. hey teacher teacher yeah um i haven't heard that expression before that's why you well i i couldn't answer you correctly you know okay that expression what does it take Four oh, or really? Two. You yeah, have, heard you heard it, you heard it, Sandra, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah, well, well but um, hey, Sandra. I suppose it, it means that, um, <laughs> que se necesita or something yeah, like that. Spanish. Yeah. Okay. okay, what do we need <laughs> or something like that? What are the requirements for? You, uh huh, you um, got it. Tell me what yeah. it takes to let you go. Oh. Adam Smith. Adam Smith. I don't know. I don't know that. Adam Smith? No. Rock no. and roll. Okay. Adam no. Smith. What it takes. That's, That's the name of the song. Classic. That's classic music. Yeah. Yes. Okay. 
let's continue, guys. I know, man, there's a lot of vocabulary you can get, but we have to move on. I missed it. Hold on. So let's talk about the past perfect, but I will do it in a simple way, okay? I don't want you to get confused. So at <clears throat> this point, can somebody explain me when does the past continuous happen? When, when someone in the room, when some when someone during a period of time in the past. In the past. Yeah. So it's, it's a period of time. Okay. Uh, continue, Jancy. The continue past. Past continue is when uh, someone in I uh, know. Yes. It's when in the past is, action yes, when, action in past. It's an action when an action is interrupted for other action. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. An action is interrupted by another action. Okay, uh, you're kind of there, but the past continues. Okay, it's what we have been using ing. Okay, um, is an action, an action that in was progress. in progress mm -hmm. exactly it was in progress and then it was interrupted okay it was interrupted by an, by another action and that's it was that contained no idea that that's the, like the main idea right now so we're clear on that right <clears throat> i was eating i was sleeping I was thinking, and then I woke up. Man, I was kissing her. I was hugging her. <laughs> I, I was sm smelling her. I was looking at her eyes, and then I woke up. <laughs> <laughs> when your father <laughs> came. That's so sad, right? Okay. That happened to me yesterday, but with my grandma. <laughs> yeah. I was remembering her somehow. Okay, so an action that was in progress in the past, okay, it was in progress and then it was interrupted. Now, let's talk about the past perfect. Okay, the past perfect. Let Should we go with the grammar first? Okay, subject had plus had. Okay. Had. <laughs> plus participle. Plus Okay. Participle. 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 Okay. Uh, okay. Plus the compliment, right? Yeah. I heard about the, the past perfect is a dinosaur's past. Yeah? I don't the know about that. It's the old past uh, between a simple past, between nah. a past continuum. Yeah. Okay. I don't know. Forget it. Forget it. Okay. So uh, let's go with this uh, really quick. Today, we're just going to talk about positive um, statements in the past perfect. So this is very similar to the present perfect. The only difference is this guy here. Had. Okay. Is the auxiliary, the auxiliary of this grammar tense. The auxiliary is had. But before we go into examples and things like that, we use it to refer to something that happened before we jumped how do we read? Okay, we jumped into the story. <laughs> That's the way I, I would like to say it. So before you jumped into the storyline, okay, into the storyline, um, something had happened. So let's start making examples. Walter, give me an example. Um, oh my god. <laughs> to the storyline. I have uh... <clears throat> I have past participle. 
I had gone. I was thinking I was gone too. I had gone. Mm -hmm. I had gone to the beach. To beach? Or to the beach. To the beach. Uh huh. Uh, the. Um, once month, once month ago. Uh, uh, okay. Now no. let's let's focus. We use it to refer to something that happened. Something that happened. Okay. Yeah. I had gone to the beach before we jumped into the storyline, or uh -huh. before something else happened. So I had gone to the beach one month ago. When yeah, it arose. she came home. Okay. I had gone to the beach when she came home. So I wasn't home. Mm -hmm. Okay. So I wasn't home. That's the result. Mm -hmm. um, she... Okay. Think about it. This had happened. I had gone to the beach when she came home. So my sister came home, but I wasn't home. Yeah. Because I had gone to the beach. It was too late. It was too late. Yeah, she came too late. It was too late. Another you, way. Uh -huh. Another way you need to combine with another with another tense. For example, you use a simple pass, like I interrupt when you're using a past continuous. You could use past continuous or past simple. Let's look at the very common example. By the time police arrived, ah. the reckless, check that word, please. Reckless. Driver, uh -huh. by the time police arrived, the reckless driver had gone, had, um, how do you say, have, fl have fle 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 flown, have flown away. Flown. Flee, flown, flew, flown, hold on. Am I right? No, reckless. Reckless, without the W, okay, hold on. Uh, by the time police arrived, the reckless driver had flown away. <laughs> yeah, that, that, sounds, that sounds very appropriate, actually, to Whoa. flow away. He left, man. He left flying. He, okay. By the time police arrived, the reckless driver had, had, I'm sorry, what's going on here? Had flown away. Had flown away. Huh. Ya había volado. Which is very, yeah, it's very typical, right? Yes. Uh -huh. The reckless so, driver, temerario. Right. By the time police arrived, the reckless driver had gone, had flown, had gone away, had flown away, whatever. Okay. So this action happened before police arrived. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. And that's the past perfect. The action that happened before another one. Now that second action did not interrupt the previous one. <coughs> yeah. A teacher, hey. in a line of time, mm -hmm. what is the position of the uh, past perfect, past simple past, and past continuum in line of position? Yeah. Time position. A line of time. I know it's a little bit confusing, right? Yeah. Okay, um, here you have a little timeline and there you have a dot, basically. Yeah. Okay, so the past perfect happens before an action in the past. Yeah. Oh. Just as simple as that, you see? This is the past perfect, this blue dot. Uh, okay. okay. Okay, before another action in the past. It's simple past, yeah? Mm -hmm. Okay, I got it. Now you, of course, you can combine things. Um, mm -hmm. uh, yo me había ido de vacaciones cuando ellos llegaron a la casa, pero más tarde estaba llegando al aeropuerto. 
Ok, yo me había ido de la casa, pasado perfecto. Cuando ellos llegaron, ok, pasado simple, bueno, y más tarde yo estaba regresando al, aeropu al aeropuerto. Continuo. Pasado continuo. Yeah. Ok, y ahora estoy aquí contigo, ok, ya llega el presente. Mañana ya no voy a estar acá. <risa> ok, porque hago esto en español. Eh, como adultos es normal que nos ocurra necesitas ubicarte en tu línea de tiempo en español ¿sí? puede ser muy confuso eh, ver todo, todo en inglés de una sola vez puede ser confuso entonces ubicate en tu tiempo eh, en tu idioma, de nuevo a ver, hagamos un ejercicio súper rápido que no nos tome ni dos minutos ¿quién me regala un ejemplo como el que yo acabo de realizar? uy <ríe> come on guys Diría Sandra, cuando el doctor vino a chequear a mi esposo, ya se lo habían llevado para la, para la sala de, de, de operaciones. All right, right. Right. <laughs> so, by the time the doctor came to check my husband, they had already taken him, they had already taken him to, to, for surgery. For surgery. Taking him. Mm -hmm. For his procedure. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Let me write it. Let me write it down for you. Can, can. Come on, guys. Give me another example. Vamos a, a ver. Deme un ejemplo. Es en el español, pero yo necesito que ustedes se ubiquen en la línea de tiempo, así como dijo Walter. Una acción en el pasado antes de otra acción en el pasado. Me teacher. Mm -hmm. I went to the church last week, but when I got there, it, it, it was finished. Okay, but I, when I got there, when I got there, it had finished. It had it finished. Had finished. That's right. Quiero que notes en la segunda parte de estos ejemplos, ahí está claramente descrito eh, lo que es el pasado perfecto. I had put, okay, um, someone had stolen. I had forgotten. So subject, had, and past participle. By the time the doctor came to check. Okay. I had studied very much when the teacher said there's no exam today. No. <laughs> yeah, you got it. That's a perfect example. And then we continue studying. And then okay. That's right, teacher. Hey. I have got to the supermarket when my wife called me because I forgot my wallet. Later, because, because I, I right had Because I had forgotten my wallet. Later, I was driving back home, picking up my wallet. You got it. You got it. Just be careful with that. So your wife called you because you had forgotten your wallet uh, at home. Okay, okay, okay. You sure I try? Yeah. yeah. Daniel, and I, then we go with Janet, I think. Uh -huh. I had brought those shoes when she wanted to give them to me. Mm, I didn't get that. Do it again. I had brought those shoes. Those, those shoes. Those shoes, uh-huh. When she wanted to give them to me. I had bought this sh those shoes. Broke, okay. Broke, broke. Um, let's go by parts. I can't. Let's see. I had bought these shoes. Those shoes. Mm, these shoes. Okay. Okay. Uh huh. And then? When she wanted to give to, to give them to me. Hmm. When she wanted to give them to Broke. me. I had bought. I bought, bought, bought. I'm sorry. Bought, sorry I'm sorry. Bought, bought or brought? Traer o comprar? Bought. 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 Mm -hmm. bought. Okay. I had bought these shoes when she wanted to give them to me. When she wanted to give them to me. She wanted to give it to me. Um, okay, yeah, that, that sounds like right. I, I'm sorry, Jacqueline, were you 
Yes, you have yes example? Sister, I'm gonna try. Yeah, please. Uh, I have gone by to market when I remind to forgot the cheese and I back to buy it. To buy it. And I went back to buy it. Yes. And I went back to buy it. Okay, I had gone um, to buy at the market. When I remind. When I remembered. When I remember that mm -hmm. I forgot the cheese. That I had forgotten. That I forgotten the cheese and I come back to buy it. So I came back. I came, came back. To buy it. To buy it, yes. You got it. I had gone to buy at the market when I remembered that I had forgotten the cheese, so I came back to buy it. So I came back for it. I came back for it. So I came back to buy it. Joaquin. Yes. Uh, I have an example. Please. Okay. Why we have understood the English class when teacher changed the topic. Uh, <laughs> 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 we had understood the class, yes. okay. Understood. Uh -huh. Hey, look at this. Uh -huh. We had understood in English class when the teacher changed the topic. And then the mm -hmm. teacher changed the topic. topic. We had understood the class. Okay, so good, good example. I hope that's not the case, but yeah. Okay, <laughs> so <laughs> how do you use this? I, I. Uh, you'd, you'd, okay, he'd, mm -hmm. she'd, and so on, okay? It's just the apostrophe, the, in each one of the subjects. Um, another way to contract this as usual with is with the negative. Hadn't, I hadn't said anything. I hadn't, I hadn't, I hadn't told you yet. I hadn't told you yet and you just reacted really well. Look at that, I hadn't even mentioned him and you reacted all toxic. I hadn't even mentioned him and you reacted all toxic. <laughs> That's a clear example. Ni siquiera lo había mencionado. Yeah. Y tú reaccionaste toda tóxica, right? Okay. <laughs> okay. That's an example. So continue making your own examples. Understand it. Yes, please. Last example. Go ahead. Okay. I have practiced several English expressions to buy some Disneyland tickets in Los Angeles. When I heard the cashier had said, ¿Cuántas boletas quiere? <laughs> you kidding me. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> when he saw your face, he oh, was oh, like, yeah. <laughs> Hola, mija. Hola, mamita. ¿Cuántas <laughs> boletas? <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> and, and what did you do, Sandra? Did you go like, why you talk to me in Spanish? Come on, guy. Oh, come <laughs> I don't on. understand. I don't understand. Oh, my God. I came here to practice. <laughs> Los americanos se molestan si no les habla en inglés. Uh -huh. Muchos americanos. Yo vine acá a practicar mi español. Y tú, tú no hablas en inglés to me. No hablas en inglés to me. <laughs> no, hombre, chévere. <laughs> Tranquilo, Chele. <laughs> okay, guys. I'll see you tomorrow, okay? Thank Practice. You, you, send send me your examples to the chat on WhatsApp, okay? Very good. Bye. Okay. I gotta go. Good night, Bye. Thank you. Good night. Bye. Bye.